Minister of Federal Capital Territory, Barrister Nyesomwike, has highlighted the importance of catering to the judiciary to ensure equity in delivery of justice. Barrister Wiki made this statement during the flag off ceremony for the construction of 40 judges' quarters in Abuja. The minister noted that strengthening the judiciary is a key objective of President Bola Tinubu's administration. Here's our FCT correspondent, Naomi Oleribe, with more details. Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Barrister Nyesam Wiki, emphasized that housing is a fundamental aspect of livelihood and the government must be committed to the welfare of judges to boost their morale and enhance productivity. We must, in all times, provide housing, but that can only be better if you have owner occupier. And so every judge will know that at the end of the day, I'm retiring from office, I have my own uh, home. With that, it will be difficult for anybody to manipulate or interfere when you have a home. What are you afraid of? When you know that salaries and allowances can be paid when you are retired, when you know that your tenure of office is guaranteed, that of course anybody will defend, anybody will be courageous to do his work or her work. In her remarks, the Chief Justice of Nigeria, Honorable Justice Kudirat Kekere Eko, we affirmed the judiciary's pivotal role in upholding the rule of law and safeguarding the rights of citizens. She stressed that a conducive environment is necessary for the judiciary to function independently and impartially. This initiative is an essential part of creating an enabling environment for the judiciary to discharge its constitutional duties effectively. I am confident that this project will be executed to the highest standards and completed within the expected time frame. At the event, the minister handed over certificates of occupancy to the heads of the FCT High Court, Court of Appeal and the Federal High Court. Out of the 40 housing units, 20 will be allocated to the FCT High Court, while the Court of Appeal and the Federal High Court will receive 10 units each. Naomi Oleribe, ADBN News.